All right, what's good, everybody? It is Michael. I'm with Swagstar Beats, swagstarbeats.com. Yeah, there's a lot of fucking talk about Waves plugins right now. Um, going to the subscription model, I actually previously purchased uh, quite a few Waves plugins, and I don't agree with what they're doing, but I would like to show you something I discovered and a workaround. So... Based on the subscription model, I watched a couple of videos. I was all like, hold on, let me launch Studio One and kind of make sure all of my already existing plugins work. However, when launching Studio One, I noticed that there were plugins that were broken. So here's what I discovered, right? So if, if we go to Wave Central, you can see here like BB Tubes, CLA 76, H Delay, Kramer, Sh Ship 73, Studio Rack, SSLG, Master Bus Compressor, blah, blah, blah. Like, these plugins I'm having issues with, right? So, I went ahead and loaded my normal template, my normal mixing template. And as you can see, my H delay is broken. My WLM is broken. Um, however, I found a workaround, right? So, if we look here in Studio Rack, oh... The, 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 these these plugins work 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 fine. So he, here's my workaround: if if you're using Studio One or if you have pre-existing Waves plugins that you purchased that are no longer working, right? So H delay is broken. We're gonna go ahead and remove H delay. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add a Studio Rack. We're going to go ahead and full reset this. And then we're just going to add H delay within the studio rack. So this would be a workaround as far as if a plugin is broken and you can't just add the plugin itself. Like if I was just to add H delay, you know, try to add it, you know, to the track, nothing happens. So if you have any Waves plugins that are no longer functioning within your DAW, just load in a studio rack, add the add the plugin that's not working to that, and you should be good to go. Keep in mind, there's a lot of these Waves plugins that I formerly used and will still probably be using temporarily that I will probably end up replacing because what what they've done I don't totally agree with, but I've become so accustomed with using the plugins that it's going to take me a little bit to sort of migrate to, you know, other other vendors, manufacturers, and things of that nature. But I definitely just wanted to get on here for a minute and, you know, give you a workaround, let you know what I noticed, you know, plugins that look broken. You're like, well, shit, you know, I, I, I used age delay. It's my favorite delay. Now I can't use it. You can just put it in a studio rack. It's Mike at Swagstar Beats. I hope this helped. Have a blessed day.